Ladies, our next guest is an Emmy, an NAACP Image Awards winning actress who's made us laugh for over four decades with roles in classic shows like 227 and Sister Sister. Now she's appearing on Days of Our Lives, my favorite soap of all times and Netflix series Family Reunion. Please welcome the phenomenal queen, Jackie Harry. Hello, Jackie. Hello, Jackie. What's happening? Hey. It, How are you? Hey, I'm good. I know all of y'all. I don't know Selena very well, but I know y'all. What's up, y'all? How you <laughs> y'all a mess? A mess. But I, I love you and I adore you. We love you um, back. We yeah. love you too. And thank you for, for being here. Uh, we, we I was really looking forward to this. Now we hear you're a grandmother, or should I say a grandma? And when you have time off, what's your like favorite things to do with your grandbabies? What kind of stuff do y'all do? Um, well, they are closer to their grandfather, Elgin Charles. They, they like him better. They don't like me as much yet, but I let them know that you will grow up and be a person. I'll still be here. So they, they, um, I'm a disciplinarian, you know, and I'm a teacher and I want them to learn. And my, my, um, my grandson, Kaiden, he's three, very smart. So I want him to, you know, go to Harvard right now. And, okay. uh, <laughs> and the little girl, I'm ready to spoil her rotten. She's only a year old. So I'm ready to spoil her absolutely rotten, then give her back to her mother. But I'm so happy for them. And he has a family and, and his fiance, Aubrey, they are very happy. And that makes me happy. I didn't know that. Who knew? Who knew I care about his happiness more than my own? You know, well, I love I share that with you, girl. I share that because I'm a, I'm a glamma too. And when I tell you, I didn't, I didn't understand what grandmothers felt until I am feeling it now. Like she can absolutely do no wrong. But you know, I think that I need to come over there with you because you said you're a disciplinary and I am not. I whooped my baby like two weeks ago and fell all the way out. Well, I'm talking crying. And everything. <laughs> I was like, oh my God, I can't believe it. Now, Jack A, <laughs> look, we gotta, gotta take it back here because the world like fell in love with you, girl, as you know, Sandra on uh, 227, right? Mm -hmm. And did you have any idea how iconic that role was going to become. No, and uh, I still don't. I don't, I didn't, you know, I didn't embrace that character for years. I um, I said I'd be typecast because, you know, I said I'm a good actress and people will only see this. So I was like, oh, please. I tried to downplay it and go back to acting in theater in New York. I really did. I thought I was going to Really? Like yeah, I was going to quit it and go back and just do movies and theater. You know, I was like that. I was, I wanted to be like Diana Sands. Great actress, and I said I'll I'll win an Oscar and blah blah blah. But then <laughs> Essie Payton Merkelson, she told me, you know, from Law and Order, she said, "Girl, you're important. Don't you know that?" Ooh. Four seasons, y'all know the four seasons. I know y'all mm -hmm. know. We were having cocktails, <laughs> and she got me straight. So it put me on the path. And Regina talks about it, and so a lot of young ladies I've affected and influenced. So I'm not mad at it now, but it took me years, and I mean years, to accept it. It really. Yeah. You got another role though, because you to me, you're just everybody's favorite auntie. Like when I see you, I just know what to expect. You're gonna bring the funny, you're gonna bring the humor, you know what I mean? You're gonna bring a big presence whenever you come. And so I can imagine you saying that the role 227 was kind of like, eh, that's my first thing, I you know. But your second thing, sister to sister, your character <laughs> Lisa. You know what I mean? On there, you know what I mean? It's like you went from one thing to another thing and to another great thing, you know what I mean? And you just constantly keep working, you know? So with all these reboots going on, you think maybe, you know, y'all might have a reboot on your hand with that? So yeah. sister, maybe. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. It's in the offing. So we'll see, you know, if it comes up. But I don't, you know, I live in the present now, especially with all this crap. And I call it crap because now it's so old. It's just old, you know. COVID is old to me, you know. Plus, I'm I'm shot up. Y'all don't know. I'm letting everybody know I'm shot up. I got everything. I went and got in somebody's car, and they took me on in. And said, Come on. I said, uh, "You got any left?" They said, "Here." I said, "Here," well, you know. And I had no side effects except a sore arm. So mm. everybody know. And if you just pick up the phone and call, you can get an appointment. I, I don't. Everybody can. And a lot of people don't know it. You can go, but the the thing I'm saying is I don't feel that um, stress anymore. But I don't even know what we're talking about. What were you talking about? I was going to ask you, do you see how that show resonates with this generation now? Didn't know it. Didn't know. You know, I never look at myself. I don't know if you guys do. I don't think Vivica does. I look. I used to look in the early days to see how I looked, how my chin works, how you look, how you know, you know your good side, your left side. 
I don't do all that anymore because you start to pick at yourself. So, yeah. yes, you know, you don't, you got to be kind to yourself. I'm learning. Be kind mm-hmm. to yourself. And you go audition for something, which I still do. And, and I leave it in the room. So that's what I do. I come, like Lisa Ray, I come in, make an impression. If it don't work, it don't work. But I don't lament it. I don't go, oh, I didn't get that anymore. I used to cry over parts I lost, maybe two. Can I just jump in there real quick? Because you're right, Jackie. When we, when I first started acting, I used to be so opinionated about like every little thing and, and, and take it. And it's like, now it's like, I am who I am. I'm finally comfortable in the skin I'm in, you know? Yeah, I know you said some great things when you said meetings. You said, I ain't got no more stories to tell. Okay, you take this or leave it. You know, when I love you for that. You know, I think that's because we love it. Uh huh, love it. Yeah, because you really have to learn to be yourself and it takes years to develop and evolve. Agreed. Yes, you know, and you still, you know, you still got to make it work. You know, like my my baby didn't get nominated for her, her director. Regina and I, I like, know oh. I saw that but you know what guess what the world tells you no sometimes it tells you no and you go True. okay I got this I got this. and she's mature she's not yeah, sitting home crying you know it she, yeah. yeah it always does and you know why I'm gonna say no I'm not gonna play no card here I'm just saying there was a lot of competition and diversity doesn't just mean black anymore it means women exactly well see and right. This, convers- this conversation that the, the three of you ladies are having is these are nuggets. The um the fact that you all all agree that you don't look at your stuff anymore. You don't pick at your stuff anymore. That is a big deal because I just recently started being like, I'm not watching it back. And people be like, why, why, why you don't want to watch it back? And it's for the very same reason, because yeah. I don't want to pick at myself and I don't want to mm-hmm. bring myself down, sitting up criticizing myself the whole time. Yeah, speaking speaking of Regina King. Um, Jack, you have worked with so many amazing people from Tia, Tia to, and Tamara, Regina mm-hmm. King, Marla Gibbs. I mean, so many great artists. What is probably, I mean, you've done so many projects, you've put in so much work and content. What is the most fond memory that you could think of to share with us out of all that you've done? Um, I don't know about all, but I've had some great, great angels, I call them, uh, and Brandon Tartikoff, the late great, he was the head yes. of programming for NBC. He got me my got me two two seven because I wasn't the first choice. Mm. And a lot of people don't know that yet, but he said, "No, she's funny. She's the one." And he fought for me. And I, I love him. Mm. And I have angels now, and you know, and they're all producer writers. And that's why I'm I'm, I'm doing Days of Our Lives. Um, the producer <gasps> said, I'm "Writing for you." When somebody writes for you, I don't know about you guys, but. It's very rare somebody that writes for oh, you. Yeah. The, they call you right, say, I got a character Surprise. that I wrote for you. And oh, it's very right. flattering. But when you read it, you go, oh, it is. So, the, you know, that you have angels and you have people who, it's not just who you know, it's who knows you. So, Selena, mm-hmm. that's the question. So, yes. Yeah, so, I, I'm aware of the icon thing. But you know what I say. Legends don't get laid. And I still, you know. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be a legend. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Watch out now. Watch out. <laughs> I don't mind being a leader and a role model in a limited sense meaning you know if I say shit I said it okay you know so yeah I was saying people don't curse they do but I try to be respectful of people and make them feel good about themselves you know you know unless they put their hand on me then it's a whole nother like Lisa Ray said that's a whole nother story (laughs) that happened it's a whole nother story <laughs> that part. Okay, you're getting a ton of comments in 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 the chat on on youtube and they're all saying black don't crack and how fantastic you look and how amazing you look and speaking of looks they're also talking about how you and kim whitley look so much alike uh, are you tired of that that comment oh how do you feel about that y'all do look a lot oh, alike okay, um i met her and she was my stunt double you know i had a movie and i you know mm-hmm. i hired her you know because she looked mm-hmm. just like me from the side and mm-hmm. she's very respectful. She doesn't do that. You know, I had trouble with, I told her, I said, get your own brand because later on you're going to want it. You mm-hmm. wanna, you're going to want to be known to be Kim Whitley, not looking like Jack A or we want a Jack A type and they call you. Be your own. So she's done. She's done that. And she's evolved. She's very funny, very good looking. Yes. You know, so she comes into her own and she's taller than me. A lot of people don't know that. <laughs> you know, so no, I don't put her down. You you go for it, you know. And like you were saying, I don't know. Um, was at least a ray they grab little pieces of you and say it's their own mostly in the record business mostly but also they try to do that there they do little things you see you see yourself and other people and you go mm, you know but mm-hmm. i don't put them down but take it use it but then change it and make it your own you know because aretha mm-hmm. franklin look at look at that we all want to be aretha all of us i was in here singing with cynthia on the thing i was like i used to sing like aretha i used to copy her 
you know, her, all her intonations, like Natalie Cole had that beef. So you use it and then you incorporate it into yourself. You know, don't just steal it. You know, don't yeah. just you know, hijack it. But you can <laughs> use the role models. You know, in music, you hear little tones, you know, hey, like Lionel Richie in the Grammys. I love him singing. And he wrote that song, Lady, for Kenny Rogers. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't know that, but it made me feel a certain way. That's what I want. I want to feel a certain way when I see a performance. You know, I want to see. I want you to move me, you know, some well, kind of way. Well, the people want to see more of you. So we're going to be back with more with Jackie when we return. on. I love you, Claudia. We did a movie together. Claudia produced the movie. I was in a movie. Yeah. 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 She had a yeah. fine young man, too. Lord, have, Lord have mercy. <laughs> we'll be back with more before she gets me in trouble. <laughs> that was then. That was long, 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 long time. Long, yeah, long, 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 long. 10 years ago. You know what? I always call you just Jack A, and I keep slipping. I'm over it. I, I, I know. I, I, I know. I just call you Jack A, and I don't like to even use your last name because you're just Jack A. Like you're a one name woman because yep. you you Everybody are. Who you talking about? No confusion. It's you know, yeah. like a Jack A. Jack A. Who? Jack A is a you're household just, name. That's you a household are. Name. You are, and and I love like how you've able to just reinvent and continue to just keep yourself out there with all these roles from, from the, from, I don't even know when it began, how long ago, it just seemed like I've always seen you on television. I've always seen you, you've always had a presence. And now you have, you know, the, the Netflix series, Family Reunion. And, and on top of that, your social media presence. Um, we got to talk about both, but can I ask you about your social media presence first? Well, it, yeah, it was spawned by Tia and Tamara because they were on it first. Actually, uh, Tamara was the first one on it. And I said, why are you on there? You know, and even Marcel. She, I said, why are you on there? They said, it keeps you current and relevant. I said, who cares about that? But I got on there. And when Regina and I did Watch What Happens Live, we walked from the car to the lim We walked from the limousine to the studio back. I had 300,000 followers in less than 45 minutes. Wow. Oh, my God. And that's when I knew the power of it. She had more. It was phenomenal. You what know? kind of feedback did you get when you said this comment about, you said not Takashi looking for six to nine inches after it was said that he was sliding in the DMs of Little Nas X. Please tell us about that. And did you get any clap back or people like tripping on that? Were they, were they, oh. were they? No, I got some action, but I had to run, child. I fled. I, I, I it was true. I, ooh, I don't want to tell you what. I love now. when she does that. No, I said, let me see it. I, and honey, I, I, I got shocked. I, I'm not so bold anymore, honey. I, Join the party. I make sure my foot is in that limo first. Uh, I don't. <laughs> oh Lord, did it bother you when people were come? Did it bother you the feedback? No, 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 because they know I'm, I'm full of crap, but everybody does it. Men don't know. You know, and I talked that way before, but now I can't because I can't back it up. I can get in the bed, but I don't know if I can get out. You know what I mean? So, <laughs> Claudia, you know what that means. <laughs> what are you saying? Yeah, but I, uh, getting back, I miss seeing you guys. I wish y'all were at the Grammys. I do miss seeing some people, you know, made up. I wish some people were dressed more, you know, more fly. You know, that's what I miss. You know, you know I love Cardi B. That was my favorite. Uh, and Meg Thee Stallion. I love Savage. That's my favorite. So, but I miss seeing you ladies there. You know, Viv, no, I like to see a splash. I miss seeing y'all all done up and vivacious. You know, that and that informs me. I like to see my girls. You know, you too, Selena. You're a great performer. I just like to see that. It makes me feel uh, on the young side of old, I call it. That's the name of my, my uh, memoir, The Young Side of Old. Mm. Oh, when is that coming, darling? I don't know. When I, you know, <laughs> I, 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 a couple more people got to die. Well, Ma, one of them died the other day. Marvin Hagler. Yes, I did him. Yes, let's just say. <laughs> How was he as a lover, Jackie? He was good. Yeah. Was, yeah. Would he be in your top three? No. Oh. Who was your top three if we know of them? No, I can't say now. They still alive. They're not. <laughs> <laughs> so when they die, can yeah, you come back and tell her? He hung on, put it that way. <laughs> he hung, he hung. Uh -oh, uh -oh, he hung. Uh -oh, on. Uh oh, here we go. Here oh, we go. No, I mean, he was, he, he, I lasted three rounds. Mm. <laughs> so yeah, don't awesome. kiss and tell. Don't kiss and tell. Do you have a celebrity crush, Jackie? Do you have a celebrity crush? Brad Pitt is my celebrity crush. He fan. I, I met him when he was younger with very curly hair. Robin Gibbons and uh, Holly Robinson Pete introduced me to him. When they were on head of the, she was on head of the class and Holly was on jump 
you know, and Johnny Depp. I love them because they are so warm and wonderful. You know, just, I don't know, there's something soulful about them. And, you know, I know they're white guys and everything, but they are some two of the nicest, nicest guys. And they're still that way. They're real cool, you know, so I like that. But in terms of actually going to bed with, no, I ain't got no celebrity questions now. I've, I've, I'm pretty much good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got a couple of y'alls I would like to have, but I, uh, I don't do I don't do my girls. Such yeah. ass. Uh, you know who I'm talking about. This. Tell us. Who's your female crush? Fitty. No, Fitty. Oh, oh, oh him. Oh, well, she said a couple yeah. of y'alls. Mm, she said y'alls. Yeah, Erica, y'all. What do you think about that? What would you tell her? What if y'all been what I would have loved to have been with, you know? <laughs> what, 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 what would I tell her about that experience? Or advice? Because oh, I... lovely. Yeah, you know, lovely. You had great things to say. It wasn't, it wasn't negative at all. Yeah. No, he's, he's fine. He's yeah. Good. Yeah. Ah! Oh, yeah. oh, Keep it 100. He can be a whole bunch of stuff, but if ah! it is, honey. That, that, that was not the problem at all. Okay. At all. Okay. Because you know, Vivica, uh, you do. You do. You do. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to take a sip on that one too, Jack A. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay. If you're watching, Jack A has a little crush on you, and Vivica gives her permission. Vivica said, it ain't no fun. The homie can't no, have it. It. it ain't no fun. Hey, the homie hey, can't. Hey. So I'm just, I'm just giving. Yeah, I'm just giving crazy. So, Miss Jack A, I, I wanna, I got a question. Okay, so that you're in. So, so because you're into social media, what do you do? When the people act a fool on social media, do you get do you get with them? Do you check them, or do you just let them just no, say? Whatever? I like to check them. You, they, you clap back. I, like I love it. Them. I love you know, it. I'm still mad at a couple of people, yeah, because they <laughs> think they're not hearing the whole story. And texting and social media can't say it all. Sometimes you just put your face out there and say, "This is what I said, and this is what I meant." You know, and even in a text, you can give the wrong inference, you know, so I, yeah. I try to avoid it. But um, I've, I've had beats with people I don't even know over Twitter. And you go, why am I beefing with somebody I don't even know and don't care about? <laughs> you want to get it straight. You know, you agree. Straight. Yeah. You know, I'm still mad at a couple of people. And when I see them, I'm ready. <laughs> when this COVID is over, I'm, I'm going COVID cold. So remember, <laughs> remember, remember love when you, her. you know, got to love her. Okay, we could talk to you like all day. You are so fun, and I just love your spirit. I really yes. thank, thank you for coming and hanging out with us. And I want everyone to make sure they support you on Days of Our Lives and on your Netflix show, Family Reunion. You're doing your thing, and please keep giving it to these people on social media. We are so here for a queen, and 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 we love you. We really love do, you guys. We love you. Love your show. Ah. Thank you so much. I want to thank Jackie Harris for. Oh, she did it again. <laughs> I have a good. I'm a cut up. Just, Some, something's wrong with me today. I something's wrong with me. You can kick my ass when you see. No, I want to thank Jack A. Harry for joining us. Please watch her on Days of Our Lives on NBC.